Well, as cute as they may be, prairie dogs can be a nuisance. And at one office park in Lafayette, they're also too close for comfort. Business owners tell us there are plans to have them removed, but not everyone is on board with how best to do it. Denver 7's Patrick Perez explains the push to save the prairie dogs. They're cute. They're certainly loud. And many will say they're a nuisance. I definitely think they need to be relocated, um, just a little bit too close to office space. Dr. JJ Wellman owns Happy Paws Veterinary Hospital here at the Westgate Office Park in Lafayette. It's right next door to this bustling prairie dog colony. They don't belong, you know, adjacent to office buildings, yeah. but Thankfully, there is a place for them to go. The roughly 150 prairie dogs have caused enough problems that there are now plans in place by the owners association to remove them. But how Dr. Wellman's been told that will be done doesn't sit well with her. We've only reached out to one company. The one company quoted 15 to $30,000 to trap as many as they could and fumigate the rest. Instead, she would like them all to be relocated, not just some, and find a way for a new colony to not prop up again. She's also concerned about how the fumigation would affect the animals in her practice just feet away. We love animals and that's why you know, I've dedicated my life to this. So we're we're all supposed to just watch as the prairie dogs are being fumigated out back. Like it's just not right. A proponent of the relocation and possible fumigation is the Boulder County Housing Authority. It owns a preschool nearby and the five lots around it where these prairie dogs currently reside. In a statement, a spokesperson says BCHA supports relocating the maximum number of prairie dogs possible to help protect the preschool children and minimize contact with adults whose health may be at risk. Dr. Wellman just wishes it wasn't at the cost of the prairie dogs lives. I've already been outvoted, but I'm hope hoping some media attention will help help others advocate and uh, for everyone to be a little bit more thoughtful about this decision. In Lafayette, Patrick Perez, Denver 7. And there is an association meeting scheduled for Wednesday morning where businesses and the Housing Authority will learn more about plans to remove the prairie dogs. We reached out to the association tonight and haven't heard back.